so rich on emeralds right now, it's not even funny, okay? We built this village trade-in hole recently, and it's basically a fish factory. It's, uh, it's full of fishermen, and we've got loads of fish farms going on. And every single trade-in session with these guys now, I end up leaving with over a beacon base worth of emeralds. <laughs> so instead of leaving my trade-in hole with a couple stacks of emeralds, we're leaving with a couple stacks of emerald blocks. I have so many, it's insane. <laughs> and I did want to work on this place today. I wanted to, to decorate it some. It doesn't look very good in here right now. Oh god, there's a big slam. <laughs> Okay, got that taken care of. Yeah, I wanted to work on this area a little bit today, make it look pretty, but um, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna be doing it right now because we have some business to attend to. Yeah, because I've been pranked. Okay, I've been pranked. There is a thing up there above my base, and uh, I know who did this. This was Jessie B. I actually logged in while she was doing this. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and she told me to go away, okay? So, uh, <laughs> I know, I know who did it. And I have a night vision potion here so we can, we can see it properly. It's, uh, it's an angry mushroom from Super Mario, right? <laughs> That's what that is? <laughs> I haven't played a Mario game in a while. And there's a Jazzy here holding a book. Let's, uh, let's kill it and have a look. Oh, hang on, I disconnected. I'm back. Okay, right. Book says, sorry, am I blocking your view? Don't worry, it's only about four blocks, Jesse B. <laughs> oh no, we got a we got a Jesse avatar of it though. Look at that. I didn't have one of these. Nice. Uh so I feel like I need to explain what's going on because I don't think I've talked about it in a video yet. <laughs> oh, my head. We have a place right here that is called Chaos Hill and the whole idea here is that we're all just building on top of each other. It's all super crazy. There's lots going on and uh, yeah, I think it's turning out pretty good, right? It looks pretty chaotic and and I love it. <laughs> uh, this is our build right here, this lucky block. And Jesse B had this thing that I didn't know about, right? So let me go inside Jesse B's house. This is Jesse's house. And if we go all the way to the top of this staircase here, we'll eventually <laughs> come out at her balcony, right? And she likes this view. She likes this view. She didn't want anything getting in the way of her view, okay? And she thinks that that right there, that lucky block that I made, is blocking her her entire view here okay <laughs> like like what am i what am i actually blocking over there like seriously what is what is over there that she so desperately needs to see okay <laughs> what that little bit right there she really needs to see that little bit right there i'm so confused because you walk out onto her balcony and look at this view okay she like has the best view on the server right now okay <laughs> How is that, like, blocking all of this? And you know, now that I know she, she dislikes her view being blocked, I kinda wanna block it even more. <laughs> <laughs> if I fly off this way, this is actually where she lives right now, okay? She doesn't even live over there. Uh, so like, what the heck, okay? <laughs> and also, another thing, she is like my best customer at Lucky Block. So like... What? Would be a shame if someone was to build something here that would block her view, you know? <laughs> uh, I just want to go around blocking her view all the time now. Oh, and really quickly, while I restock my emerald store here, I want to I wanna say we're all friends on this server, okay? Do not go being mean in anyone's comments. I've had a few, few comments as well throughout my time on Truly Bedrock that I've not really liked, that have been a little bit mean because uh, I've gone into some prank wars with people. So don't go doing that to other people, okay? <laughs> I would hate for people to go over to Jesse and, and, to, and to, to leave mean comments. Go and watch Jesse's perspective and, and have a laugh with us, right? We're all friends. We're all a part of the same team here. And uh, yeah, anyway, I've got my emeralds stocked up. I've got one, two, three, 
nearly four double chests full of emeralds. So yeah, we're gonna be... <laughs> We're gonna be pretty good on emeralds now at this point forward. I'm not saying all of you guys are horrible people or anything It's just that I, we, we do like get the odd troll, right? I'm sure the majority of you guys are amazing and understand that we're all we're all just goofing around and uh, <laughs> I just I just I felt like I needed to say that there. But anyway revenge uh, I do want to get a little bit of revenge on Jesse B for doing this. I guess I have a a, uh, a bunch of diamonds now. I'm gonna grab those and we are gonna head over to Slack Lizard's base because we're doing shops at base of the season and Slack has just recently opened up a wool shop, which looks adorable by the way. But yeah, let's go in in here. I've not actually been inside here yet, but we're gonna use wool for our revenge. <laughs> There's some ships and what's the prices in here? All wool, four stacks for one diamond, four stacks. I don't need four stacks of some of, of some of these. I'm gonna need like a couple bits of blue wool. We get four stacks per diamond. That's insane. Okay, All right. So I'm gonna need, like I said, some blue. So we'll take take four stacks of that. What else do I need? We're gonna need some brown, some green, light gray, regular gray, some yellow, light blue, and some white as well, probably. And I think we should be good with what we've got here. Man, I feel like I'm robbing him, leaving the place with wool at wool. For, for such a low price. <laughs> His iron shop is actually pretty cheap too. It's the exact same price actually. It's four stacks for one diamond, which is uh, which is pretty low. <laughs> anyway, let's go back to base. Actually, no, let's go over here to the used store because Piggy is selling wood and we're gonna need a bunch of spruce wood here. So let's take... All of that, as much as we can carry. Looking at the base from over here, and I'm super, super happy with the way it's turned out so far. Do any of you guys remember as well when we stood in this position right here, and we were trying to figure out where we wanted to build our base this season? I wasn't sure if I wanted to build it down there, on the flat snow plains, or if I wanted to go off over here, because it's a really pretty view, <laughs> and do it right there. I feel like building our base in this spot right here would have been so, so, so difficult with all of the, the terrain being all over the place. I am, uh, I'm pretty happy we decided with that area right down there. I'm loving it so much. We're not even done yet. We've got loads, loads, loads more to do. But I think it's looking great. Anyway, we're back over the Chaos Hill to get our revenge. So, Jessie B doesn't like her view being blocked, obviously, right? So we're gonna go ahead and, and block it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so we have this big open area right here, which we're gonna we're gonna fill with a pixel art of her view. Okay, it was a brilliant idea that I had in the Discord from someone, and uh, I think I think I know how I want to do it. So let's get going. Right. So first things first, we're just a few blocks away from Jesse's house here. We're gonna build a picture frame. So I've got a. 43 block long line here that is temporary. These bo blocks along the bottom are temporary. These blocks that I'm currently placing are permanent. So I'm gonna place all of these facing up like that. And then we're gonna strip these. Then let's take out the temporary blocks. Actually, we're gonna go ahead and make this three blocks wide. And it's gonna be 20 blocks tall, so I've already done the other side, and I'm just about done with this side right here too. So we need to strip these then. Can I just drop down? No. <laughs> Didn't do too bad, nearly got them all. But we're gonna strip all of these as well, and obviously do a, uh, a free block wide line all the way down to connect to that side as well so that we have a rectangular shape going on for our picture frame. Okay, there we go. I've got the rectangle built up and that is gonna block like all of your view. I love it. <laughs> so next, let's grab our crafting table and I'm gonna make a bunch of spruce 
trap doors. And I want to do spruce trap doors all around the center of this here. So the middle spruce log, we're going to put a spruce trap door all the way around. It's going to be really, really awkward to do the underneath. Just put some uh, some dirt that we can stand on, I guess, and we'll do it like that. I got that done, and it doesn't do a whole lot to the build, but I still wanted to do that anyway. It adds a little bit to it, I guess. So now we can start to <laughs> to draw the the mountains in the background here, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna make a little bit of progress, and I will be right back. I am so, so hoping that she doesn't tear this down when it's done. <laughs> Hopefully it stays here, um, but I made a start here anyway. We've got the grass here, and some dirt, and some stone, and some water. There's like a flowing water thing. You can just about see it right there. That's what that is. That's about a third of it done. All right, I think it's looking good so far. I'm liking it. I will do another third and I will be RB. Oh man, I've made some more progress and I've actually been messing around in creative. So I kind of know how I want this to turn out eventually here. But now that it's getting built up on Truly Bedrock, I, uh, <laughs> I'm loving it so much more. So we got the mountains here. Uh, there's one off here, one off here, and then this bit in the middle is kind of where Zap's observatory off over there is, right there. So we're going to include that as well. If I fly up here, we're going to land right here, and we'll grab our gray wool. We'll do three bits right there, and let's get a... Whoops, can I not throw that in there? Yeah, we'll grab that and we'll do a piece of orange on top for his uh, his roof. So there is Zap's observatory. <laughs> and for the most part, okay, it's done. The pitch is done. We just have to add the blue for the sky now. So all of the missing blocks up here are going to be the blue sky. And we'll, we'll add in a sun up there as well. So we're going to go ahead and fill in the rest of the space with light blue wool. Oh, wow, I run out. Are we out? Oh, we're out. Uh-oh. Okay. That sucks. <laughs> I guess we can uh, just make our own. I'm missing a few blocks up here. I can I can get myself some white and 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 lapis, and we can easily just turn some of the the white wool we've got left over into light blue. There's all the blue in. So I want to do a sun as well. We put in some temporary blocks, and we go off over here. We grab a yellow and we'll do a sun around here. So just a two by two of yellow wool will be good for our sun. Um, and final thing, I guess let's continue to uh, put in some temporary blocks <laughs> to get over here. I want to add a block in the corners here as well. So a block right there and we'll we'll strip it. A block down there and we'll strip it, a block in every corner and we will strip it. And we're done! We're done with the build! Let's fly off and have a look. <laughs> oh, I love it! I love it so much! So we got the mountain over here, we got the, the bit that pokes up a little bit with Zap's observatory, then the other mountain, and we've tried to do the exact same thing here. Mountain up there, mountain up there, Zap's observatory in the middle. And if we land on Jesse's balcony, close all of these. <laughs> oh no, I love it. I love it so much. I really hope she doesn't break it. She's gonna come over here and... Uh, <laughs> okay, we need to get a Tiz avatar. And we'll put it right here. And I need to kill a chicken so that we can make a book and quill so we can explain hi okay <laughs> so we can explain what's going on so we put a tiz right here and i got a book which says took a picture of your fave view for your sister there we go and i'm gonna give that to tiz there we go and <laughs> okay let me know what you guys think of this uh i think it turned out pretty good i am absolutely loving it 
Anyway, I am sadly just about time for today's episode. Hopefully you guys had fun. I had a blast putting that together up there. Thank you so much for watching, and yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.